Okay, Precious, I thought it would be much easier if we did this. All right, you are now logged in to your site and look on the side where it says Post and then go to All Posts. Now, these are your posts that are on, that show up on the site. Over here are the categories. So look at video. These are the categories that appear under. So whenever you put something under the blog category, it's going to appear under your blog. So now you know where everything is. And I'm going to change or combine the photos and the video stuff, but for now, so you can get an idea of where everything is, you can just use this. Okay, so go all the way up to the left-hand side, click Add New, or you can click it here, either one. Give it a sec. Okay, let's make a test. Um, we're going to write something. And see how you named it test? Well, right here, this is the page. This is the permalink. This is how people find the blog. So if you want to change this, you can change this here. And, um, and you can also change the name of the page here. So you want to... You want the title to be one thing, and you want the name of the page to be something else. You can change it there. Now, when I install Bitly, bit.ly, you'll see it right here, and you can get your Bitly information from there. So now I'm going to move the screen over just a little bit. Now you're going to go over to the right-hand side, and you can save a draft while you're working inside the draft. And then when you finish it, you're ready to go, you've checked it, then you hit publish. You can also schedule a post. So you hit, um, where it said edit, you can schedule this to be published in February, set the date, the year, and this is the time. The time is based on Eastern Standard Time, so, and it's a 24-hour clock. So 8 o'clock, if you put 0 or 8, that'll be in the morning. 18 is right now in the evening, and then you would just hit OK. And then you don't have to worry about these things. These are different type of posts, but you can, like, experiment with them. And then the only other thing, there's two more things you need to be concerned with. These are where your categories are. So you would click Blogs, and then we're going to scroll down. And then you need to click some tags. Tags are how people find your information on the web. So a tag is just like, for instance, if it's divorced women. So you would put divorce women and this would and then you hit add and this is how Google being Yahoo would search um, if people are finding stuff under divorced women hopefully they would pick that tag up and come here the final thing you need to worry about or need to deal with is the set featured image that's an image that I sent you for the power the PowerPoint template so you would click on set featured image let me move this over so we can see these are all your images that are on the site right now, but you're going to upload a new one. So go to Upload Files, and you can either select files from your computer or you can drag and drop a file from one folder to here. And then once you've chosen the image, let's just go to Media Library and say we're, we're choosing one. We're just going to pretend like we're choosing one. So then when you click it, this is the information for that image. This is how big it is. And then you would just click Set Featured Image. And I'm just setting that right there. So that is the image that we are talking about that's going to appear on the blog page when it shows a summary of all the blogs. Then after you do that, then you would hit Save Draft, Preview it, and you would hit Publish. That's it for now. Let me know if you have any questions. Thanks.